Major problem uno, we've got this, this thing right here. And if you fall through it, I mean, I guess I can fall through it. Ready? Geronimo! <laughs> yo, 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 everybody. Chinook B here, and welcome back to another episode of Eco. Yeah, I gotta look over this way so you don't see the cool stuff I made. <laughs> uh, so it's been a few days since my last recording, and uh, I, you know, this is gonna be a weird episode um, because this game is great. It has super potential. Um, it's also extremely frustrating. And I know I've mentioned it before, you know, it's like the thing that makes this this game so good and so unique is also what makes it very difficult to play. Um, it, I don't even know how to correctly do this. I will preface this by saying it's, I'm not pointing fingers at anybody individually. Um, this is, uh, you know, this is like, it's a problem, it's not a problem, it's, how the game is designed and how people just normally are as like their basic humanity, you know, if that makes any sense at all, right? Um, so let me, let me break it down to you. Let me show you what I've done. I'll look at, I'll show you my skills. So I have 1,723 points in cooking and I have pretty much mastered everything there is that needs to be made and learned in cooking. Now I could go up, I could spend 129 points to get the level four, you know, efficiency or whatever, but it doesn't really matter that much. I mean, look, look at this one, man, 1,345 points, no, no thanks, you know? But as far as like baking, I've learned everything. Uh, I'm available to like, juice up everybody as you can see right now i've got 403 skills per day unfortunately i accidentally ate a piece of scrap meat <laughs> so that's kind of uh, i would be at like 417 skills per day uh, but that scrap meat is throwing me off my game a little bit it'll it'll digest it was accidental right clickage um but i can make i can make the bear supreme which is good uh this one the elk wellington is honest to goodness like your best bet as far as like see it gives you carbs protein fat and vitamins and plenty of calories it's not quite as good as the bear supreme but as far as like preparation it is so much better it is so good um so that's what i've been selling to the people and i've been selling it nice and cheap for all you all you penny pinchers out there look at this 10 they can they can give me they can give me two bricks oh people have given me bricks hey 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 all right so right and give me some bricks that guy just got 50 points he got himself like all sorts of good stuff right boom let's put that over there bought him a bunch of elk wellington so see life is good i'm i'm treating the people right people treat me right but i've, I've done everything i can this is where things get a little bit squirrely I've done everything I can, and now I've started to go into engineering, right? And the reason I'm going into engineering is in order to learn uh, advanced culinary, uh, which I don't think there's anything actually to learn, uh, but in order to learn the scroll, learn the book, I need a bunch of plastic. We've been over this before, but I just wanna like really quick show you. And so in order to do that, uh, I need, Plastic, which is level three of refining. And then we've got, what is this? Refining speed and refining efficiency. Okay. Oh, look, man, it makes tallow? No kidding. Oh, tallow makes biodiesel. Uh-huh. Oh, dude, that is pretty, pretty awesome. Okay. So, but anywho, in order to uh, have learned refining, I needed to learn steel. Now that has been a, a big hurdle uh, in, in this game in general and on our server because you do have to put a bunch of points into it. Uh, it requires a lot of mining and stuff like that. Um, and here's, here's where the flaw of the game shines through. 
And I, I still I hesitate to say flaw because it's designed intentionally. Hey, wait, is it is it fixed? No, it's not fixed. Okay. <clears throat> so major problem Uno. We've got this this thing right here. And if you fall through it, I mean I guess I can fall through it. Ready? Geronimo! Geronimo! Boom. <laughs> and now we're on top of his house. Right? So uh that is a chunk error, to put it in like old Minecraft terms. Uh, I've rebooted the server a couple times, because uh, now I have the ability to do so, and it doesn't affect anything. Don't know what to do. Um, I think the only thing we could possibly do is uh, roll the server back if we had a backup that was recent enough. I don't know if the, if the, um, if the server has automatic backups or anything. Um, I wouldn't know how to do that. We'll have to have, have to have PSJ look into it. Um, or give, maybe give this map to the developers to see if they can like fix that. If it's just like a bad corrupted chunk or something, I'm not sure. But, so that's, that's a main problem. Just, but that's kind of like beside the point. Here, let me show you this awesome thing that Vortec put together. Vortec is, is kind of our main Smith guy. Um, him and Biffa. So in order to make this thing, he had to research. Let me look. <clears throat> research. He had to go through metallurgy and then metalworking, which is another 50 points, alloy research, which was another 200, and then steelworking, which is another 500. Total as a lot as an absolute lot, right? Um, and so now, as you can see, so Biffa and, and Vortec both know alloy, but Vortec is the only one at this point who has learned steelworking. It's taken a long time for him to do it. <clears throat> and then once, once he's got those points, then he's got, he had to make a big room, because you see how big this thing is, and put enough brick in it in order for it to operate. And he's even got to put Hello? He even has to put a chimney. Can we see the chimney? Yeah, had to put a chimney on top. The chimney even like blows smoke when this thing runs and causes pollution. It's, it's so cool. Uh, pollution's cool, kids. And then if you look in, man, charcoal. You can make charcoal. This thing's so great. Uh, rebar, which is gonna be great for reinforced concrete, which is something we'll need for future things, but as, as you can see, like, rebar requires casting, which is another part of, of smithing, blacksmithing, right? Um, <clears throat> and the one that I was interested in is just regular old steel. Where is steel? There, steel, which is alloy smelting level two, so they had to, like, learn that. Um, and it's been going... There's nothing in there for me. Great. Um, it's been going, but it's, I've been waiting for, how do I get this out of my, I've been waiting for <clears throat> I mean, like four, four days, which is either a really, really long time or not long at all, depending on what your frame of mind is. For me, I want to get videos out for you guys. So that is a long, long time. Um, but I'm on, I'm on what you would call probably the hardcore slash, uh, addicted end of the spectrum when it comes to games like these. Um, I want to show progression and I want to, uh, you know, I, I want to show you guys like new stuff, new and exciting stuff every episode. And I want to do it rather quick turnaround time. So this is... <clears throat> For example, I built this because I knew that I was going to take on refining for engineering, right? Boom. And uh, these, the boards are going to be, uh, they're going to be windows, concrete windows, but I'm waiting on someone to make those for me. And right now, currently, Dahl has been the only one that uh, is an active masonry guy who can do concrete stuff. And then not only did I need, do I want the concrete windows, but I needed concrete 
to make the pump jack, which I'll show you here in a second. Well, I'll show you the recipe here in a second. Um, <clears throat> so Dahl is working hard, as you can tell. Look at this, amazing. Let's go check it out really quick, because this guy, this guy has been doing the work. He is another one that you would consider to be uh, in the in the the end of the spectrum of super <laughs> super duper uh, like addicted to the game, right? So he's like moved moved this thing. Oh, speaking of which, is that dull? There's the man. There he is. So he's moved this over. He's got his cement kiln. He's got all this stuff. This is what you need to make. Uh, oh, he's making the CO2. Uh, this is what you do to, to make all of this type of stuff, right? So he's doing the work, but he's only one man. And he's trying to build his own stuff. So in order to support the needs of the server, we need more than one really dedicated masonry guy. And right now we only have one dedicated masonry guy. There's other people who are doing masonry, but they, they have full-time jobs. You know what I mean? So it's like, or, you know, they've got other games they want to play. And this is, that's the crux of the, of the, the flaw or, I don't know, I don't know what you call it. But the game requires that either everybody or a large majority of people are like way up on the high end of the spectrum. As far as like, let's get things done, let's work together and let's show some fast progress. Or people are like, let's just enjoy ourselves and be casual and like build our, build little houses and, and make little roads and just kind of have fun. There's no room for, for both of those types of people to, to live and coexist on the same server, <laughs> unfortunately. So uh, here is my machine shop table, and I'll show you what else. Let's see, storage, yeah. So I put 30 ingots and some elk wellington. I have the, I have the ingredients ready to go. Um, and then this is all the other stuff that I needed. So I've been like kind of stockpiling as we go. Like I said, I've been working so hard for the past four days trying to get another episode out for you guys. And I need two things for uh, refining. I need an oil refinery, and that takes, I've got the iron ingots, I've got the bricks, I need gears. And then down here, for the pump jack, uh, I've got the cement, I've, I've got the steel, like I still, Vortac has the other tin inside the blast furnace, so I need to get, get him to pull it out for me. Um, and then I need even more gear. So I need 30 gears. A gear is one iron ingot a piece, unless you have efficiency and, and stuff like that. Um, and the person who can do that is a caster, and right now it's only Biffa. And Biffa has been busy, so he can't get on and make those three gears for me, or 30 gears for me. And so because of that, I can't make an oil refinery and I can't make a pump jack. So, like... It, it's just, it's a flawed system for something like YouTube. You know what I mean? So here I, I've made this thing. I've got my factory kind of ready to go. I'm pretty sure I would have to increase the ceiling for the oil refinery. Pretty sure. Um, and so as a result of all of this, it's kind of, it's kind of, soured me on the game. It's put me off of the game a bit uh, because I don't like waiting around for others and I, and I don't like pushing others. Um, and that's what I've, I've ended up trying to like herd cats, so to speak, <laughs> you know, and be like, hey, can you please get on the server and make this, you know, and that's not fair to them at all. So I, I think that as much as I ha hate to say it, I am probably not going to do any more eco. Uh, it, it's a shame because you guys like it. The views are great. I like it, but um, but it's just not it's just not good for <laughs> for YouTube. At least in the in the in the end end game type stuff. Because looking at it, 
Like the next thing I would be interested in is is probably industry. And I know that's going to take a heck of a lot more steel and stuff like that. And, hey, you know, I just don't want to... I don't want to sit around and, and wait for other people, you know, to, to like make enough steel and, or gears or gear boxes or polished chrome or whatever is going to be in the upper tiers of this stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm probably, uh, I'm for now I'm going to, I'm going to end the series. I did want to like show you what we've been doing. Um, so you, you know, so, so you guys knew that this was going to be the end of the series. And, uh, and yeah, I think that's it. <laughs> All right. So, fellas, that's doing it for me. Sorry. I know you guys are, are going to be upset. I'm upset about it. But, you know, it is what it is. And, again, I want to I wanna really make sure that that the point is made. I'm, I'm not blaming other people. You, you can't blame other people for... for Playing a game different at a different speed or anything like that uh, is totally, it, it's just totally how the game is, unfortunately. All right, but fellas, that's doing it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, take care, brush your hair. I'll see you when I see you. Parsh.